Syracuse, Jim Vargas explains. Just a few days before Christmas, agencies that help the poor were still shopping at the San Francisco Food Bank today. You can take those right there, yeah. And although no one is going without right now, there may be some shortages on the horizon. The bank, which supplies more than 600 organizations around the city, is running short of canned and packaged food. Part of that is because our government commodities have been down 40% over the last year and a half. And also, the food industry is not donating as much of that type of food as they have in the past. Food Bank Director Paul Ash also says, as many consumers already know, the cost of food is going up. That is partly because a lot of grain, especially corn, is being diverted into alternative energy. It's having a ripple effect, and there is less surplus in the food, in the food system right now. Hundreds of people were lined up for bags of food today at Grupo in the Mission District. Volunteer Michael Johnson, who works in the health care industry, says his family has been helped out here for about three years. It's very important because, you know, how, seeing how things are so expensive, you get to save money that you... So you get it here, and it saves you, and you can do pay bills. And there is a growing number of people who find themselves choosing between paying bills and buying food. So many, in fact, that it's difficult to keep up with demand for assistance. The people of the food bank estimate they help feed 124,000 San Franciscans every year. The problem is another 25,000 are going without the help. Food bank officials aren't so much concerned about supplying people for the holidays. It's what's just around the corner that has them worried. And right now, our racks should be overflowing. This, should, this is a time of year where we really try to prepare for, for, the, for the tough times of January and February. Right now, we have hundreds of empty pallet positions that should be filled. So this is giving us a lot of concern. It is not too late to donate food or money even after Christmas, and the people at the San Francisco Food Bank are hoping the holiday spirit extends into the new year. In San Francisco, Jim Vargas, KTVU, Channel 2 News. You can find information about how to donate to the San Francisco's Food Bank and other charities. Just go to ktvu.com and click on web links.